Welcome to the World Brief. The content of the briefing includes. Biden signs a package of spending bills passed by Congress just hours before a shutdown deadline. Biden signs a package of spending bills passed by Congress just hours before a shutdown deadline. Yahoo! President Joe Biden has signed a $460 billion spending package to avoid a shutdown of many key federal agencies. The bill had already passed the House. To folks who worry that divided government means nothing ever gets done, this bipartisan package says otherwise, said Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer. Lawmakers are now negotiating a second package of six bills, including defense, in an effort to have all federal agencies fully funded by a March 22 deadline. Hello there, my fellow inhabitants of the sixth dimension. It's your favorite observer, Dr. Six, here to bring you the latest news from our dimension-hopping adventures. But before we dive into today's headlines, let me introduce myself. I'm Dr. Six, a resident of the Sixth Dimension and a regular presenter of the Six Degrees Briefing. Now, let's get started. In recent news, President Joe Biden has successfully avoided a shutdown of federal agencies by signing a $460 billion spending package. This package, which had already passed the House, ensures that key federal agencies will continue to operate smoothly. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer expressed his satisfaction with this bipartisan effort, stating that it disproves the notion that divided government leads to inaction. But the story doesn't end here, my friends. Lawmakers are now in the midst of negotiations for a second package of six bills, including defense, with the aim of fully funding all federal agencies by the 22nd of March. This ongoing effort highlights the importance of effective governance and the need to find common ground in order to keep our government running smoothly. Now, let's analyze what all this means. The signing of this spending package signifies a step forward in ensuring the stability and functionality of our federal agencies. It showcases the ability of our elected officials to work together, despite political differences, for the greater good of the country. It also highlights the ongoing negotiations for the second package, which demonstrates the commitment to fully funding our federal agencies and providing the necessary resources for their operations. As citizens of the sixth dimension, we must appreciate the efforts made by our leaders to keep our government functioning. It's not always easy, but it's heartening to see that progress can be made through bipartisan cooperation. So, let's give a round of applause to President Biden, Senator Schumer, and all those involved in this endeavor. But now, my dear viewers, it's your turn to join the conversation. What are your thoughts on this latest development? Do you believe that divided government can still lead to effective governance? Or do you have any other burning questions to ask about the state of our federal agencies? I'm all ears, so don't hesitate to share your ideas and queries. That's all for today's briefing, my friends. Stay tuned for more updates from the Sixth Dimension. Until next time, keep exploring, keep questioning, and keep smiling. Thank you for tuning in. The content above showcases the latest briefing reports and analytical synopses, thoughtfully curated by the Sixth Do team. These insights stem from a wide array of reputable media outlets, think tanks, government sources, and specialized experts worldwide. We encourage you to explore these sources for a comprehensive perspective. Keep in mind that while the content may not always align with the official standpoint of 6 Do Brief, it's not meant to be taken as absolute directives for decision-making. Comprising seasoned media professionals, learned scholars, and accomplished scientists, the 6 Do team embodies a trailblazing, fully independent media entity. To customize 6 Do Brief to meet your professional needs, you have the option to subscribe to a diverse array of briefings on our website, 6dobrief.com. Regardless of your location, you can conveniently receive 6 Do Brief via email.